In this video, you are going to learn how to set up table of pixels to your funnel or landing page like this. Hi everyone, my name is Nasim and you are welcome to my YouTube channel. So you will get this kind of use useful video in future. So if you are interested to see that, please do subscribe. And if you need my help to fix your conversion tracking issue, please contact me. I am a top rated freelancer on Upwork, so I am providing this kind of service. So let's drive in here. So we will use Google Tag Manager to set up conversion tracking for table ads. Okay. So this is our uh, landing page or funnel. I think uh, you already have like this and you want to set up table of pixel so table of pixel setup and conversion tracking is important because uh, if you want to get good return from your ads and if you want to increase your conversion then you need to set up the conversion tracking in right way okay so let's go to google tag manager and first of all we need to go on new and select like if you search here tabula you are not any template here let's go to uh, gallery and search tabula so i i'm pretty sure tabula has a template on their community template section so just search tabula yes here it is just uh, here you can see this is two pixels are available on both of our by tabula official so you can pick anyone from them so i just want to get tabula pixel and then add to my workspace and you can see that tabula pixel is now here so for example if i want to show you from new and hit the tag configuration and then you can see tabula uh, template are here so just select that and you need to pick your tabula account id so when you have opened that your account on tabula i probably will get a account id just simply you need to paste it here like this so you can see here is the two option base code and event pixels okay so uh, first of all we need to input the base pixel because uh, this is important uh, base pixels it will be trigger all page so this is the basic connection to tabula ads and our pixels and now save it and this is base pixel connected to tabula so first of all if i go on here and if i go to refresh you can see there is no tabula ads but now let's go to preview and connect our landing page And then you can see the tabula are showing the page view. So it's not showing here because we didn't publish this version on Google Tag Manager. So you need to keep in mind that when you set up any conversion tracking through Google Tag Manager, you need to submit and publish the version. Then it will start working. Okay. So now our basic code is working fine. Perfect. Now I just want to add more buttons like uh, if you want you can add the button click like buy now add to cart and uh, whatever in your landing page or funnel has you can trigger all all the event through google tag manager so in this video i am going to show you how to trigger add to cart so for example if i click on add to cart then you can see in google tag manager i got a new event called click and if i go to variable then you can see here is, here is the many uh, rules that you can pick so for example classes there has a class it has add to cart so uh, click text so this is pretty cool and uh, we can easily pick this up okay so let's make a trigger for sending add to cart event to table of pixels using google tag manager okay so go to new and select the tabula uh, sorry yeah here it is and 
paste your account id and you need to send the event and here you can see this is the few event are already made here also the custom event so our tag uh, event will be add to cart so that's why i picked add to cart and if you have the purchase and if you want to track purchase then you can select make purchase so in this video i'm going to show you add to cart and then trigger will be add to cart so trigger actually how i made and it's actually a select all elements and then a click text contains add to cart exactly like this okay so now it's uh, save it and save and we just need to name just uh, you need to use the meaningful name here because this is important like when you have a lot of tags in your google tag manager or dashboard then you need to identify which one is for which tag so that's why i am want to add add to cart so then save it okay and then let's go to preview again okay so when i go to preview and then if i go to the tag extend page you can see uh, the tag it's not being fired but uh, it sometimes it's need sometimes so if i refresh yes now here you can see the page view event is here and now simply click this button and when i click that button it's a add to cart event is triggered and it's passing to table apps so now you can be sure your tag is working and your setup is perfect now when you are done then go to submit and publish this version and you probably your setup will be work and you will get good roi from your ads so that's all the video for today if you need my help go to my video description section and contact me if you need any help or if you want to see more video then please do subscribe to my channel because it will be useful and it will be it it actually help me to continue working on this channel so that's all for today see you on the next one till then bye have a good day